Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Let's make it a great night, folks, and a great week. Window dressings and spades. Look at it, baby. Always do your best. Practice makes the master. By doing your best over and over, you can master the art of transportation. By doing your best, the habits of misusing your word, taking things personally, and making assumptions will become weaker and less frequent with time. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials up to, uh, trading up 296, NASDAQ's up 261, SP's up 53, gold contract down $23.10, trading at 1916 an ounce. We have silver off 27 cents, 24 dollars 92 cents an ounce. Light sweet crude off a buck 54, 104 dollars 41 cents a barrel. Notes and bonds. The 10-year note up 16 ticks, trading 122.07. 30 year up a full point, plus three ticks at 148.23. And king dollar, king dollar is down 700 ticks, trading 98, 391. Euro is 110. Yen is out here at 122.83. And the British pound is trading at 130 to one U.S. dollar. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world? In the world of the S&Ps, let's take a look at them. What do you have? Well, bottom line, we have an ABC structure up in the S&P, an ABC structure up in the NASDAQ. And you talk about straight line moves, man. It's a straight line move. The, the ABC structure is a straight line move. Now, what you have here also, folks, is this. Now, watch this. This is, this is how bizarre this is. On an ABC structure, A to B equals C to D. The A to B leg, okay, straight line move. Most times the B to C move, folks, is a huge consolidation, drives everyone crazy, goes back and forth, back and forth. My point is, in this particular case, it wasn't a consolidation. It was a slight pullback with an acceleration up again. Okay, so now what does that mean? Well, <laughs> It means a couple different things, and this is going to be really intriguing watching how this shakes out. So the SPY right now is 59 million shares. Yesterday we did 58, so the SPY is going to do some real volume. We got window dressing. You got to remember that, okay? So this is the beginning of window dressing. This is going to go over, over to Monday. So you get volume coming in. We have a price projection of 478, and right now you have 461. 478 is almost the high. So what the S&P is telling me, actually, because, because we didn't consolidate much, this will blow some minds. This is going to, we'll see whether it's going to be a blow off top, but the bottom line, my take is that it's going to spike this top, meaning that it's going to make another all time high and really blow some minds. That's in the S&P. Now, NDX 100 is different. They, it's still in a, an ABC structure up, but it's in a mo much lower position when we do the A to B equals C to D. We are at 391 and I believe let me do it this way first. That's 390 right there. Okay, so this is cool. You can see, if you're watching Tiger TV, right, you can see where I put this line coming across. That's 390. And the projection is 391. So what I expect you're going to see is that as you see the S&P spike the high, this will try to get into the high. But you can see when you lay this out, man, you know, this is, it's saying that, the NDX 100 is not going to be able to basically bust this higher level. And it's going to stop in its tracks when it gets into ice. This is actually ice, okay? Ice is where you basically consolidated for a bit. And what ended up happening in the NASDAQ NDX 100 from November 3rd going all the way over to January 5th, we're basically going back and forth. When we broke down, that was a major breakdown, okay? So it's going to be really cool, you know, watching this um, and seeing how this baby shakes out. Uh, you know, intraday today. Now, this is where, if you really understand the ABC structures, and, you, you know, the more that you do, the more you have confidence in the folks. So what happens is even intraday today, I was, I was like, oh, this is a trip. You know, they brought the market back intraday, but guess what? That's all that is. And when you take a look at it, you're going to see how light the volume was on these pullbacks, man. Your first pullback this morning, you know, had some juice in it. That, that juice was, that was at 1020. So watch this. At 1020, 
That level came down, went into a swing point from earlier this morning. That had volume of 46 million, 46,000 contracts. Now watch this though. Then you went higher, then you came back down and tried to get lower with 21,000 contracts. Now what we're doing is that we're busting the highs. You had a high volume spike uh, at 46.23. We, we're gonna blow by it. That's, what, that's how this thing more than likely is gonna run coming into the close, okay? So it's, 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 it's pretty wild, there's no doubt about it. Um, okay, so let's go over to the gold contract because they, they, they basically took this gold contract apart um, as the dollar was going lower. So GCJ, they pull this baby up. And what you're going to see is that you get 118,000 contracts, which is anemic contract volume, by the way, on the way down. We weren't having a lot of volume on the way up, but on the way down, that was anemic. And I suspect what we did, we broke the B point, and this could have been an ABC down, man, okay? Uh, the dollar saved us. So you would go, you did 118,000 contracts going into uh, 195,000. Bottom line, not an ABC structure down. What you have, you get a rejection of lower price, you have lighter volume, top side once again, um, and this is still an ABC structure, up with a 25 to 2600 number. Um, so <laughs> it's, it's pretty wild, there's no doubt about that. Um, okay, so let's go, the, the, we had a question about looking at the diamonds and see if that's an ABC structure. Oh, this is going to be interesting. This is going to be today. So, well, we'll see. Diamond, the diamonds might not get the, get the volume, but I can do this another way. If the diamonds don't have the volume, you just want to know whether the... When we come back, what I'll do is I'll... What you can do with the Dow Industrials, I'll, this is the way you should do the Dow, actually, not doing the DIA, because the DIA, it trades, but not as liquid as it should be. We'll do the volumes the major volumes in the Dow Industrials. See where that swing point is. Dow Industrials right now up 307, Nasdaq's up 265, S&P's up 53. Stay right there, folks, come right back. Mm -hmm.